everyone i hope you're all doing really well so it's the start of a new week it's monday and i'm off into uni to my lecture and then i have lots of sewing to do today because i have to get my second twirl finished and sort of think about my third twirl because we actually don't have enough time really oh let's go with my my Victoria's Secret order arrived on Black Friday. <sighs> I just ran up and down some stairs. Let's see what we got. Ooh, it's so glittery. I'm not always a fan of glitter in underwear because it can be quite scratchy. But let's have a look. First little number. Cute little pink bra. And then some matching pants. Oh no, these feel really scratchy. Uh, why do they do that? And then another bra, which I think is the same sort of shape. Oh, it looks a bit different actually. But this is like in a really deep purple. It's like this. And then the same pants in the purple. What's the time? I'm probably running late now. Hey Siri. And these are the pants. I'll link these below if you're interested in them. That is that. I really need to go to my lecture now. I was going to go to the post office and drop off a Zara thing, but I don't have time now, I don't think. So, I'll just go to uni. My outfit today, I'm literally wearing a black hoodie, black leggings, and some Nike trainers. So yeah, that's that. And I'm going to uni now. I'm back from uni and the gym and the post office and the post office was disgusting today there was like I was in there for like 20 minutes it felt like <laughs> I've never seen such a long queue in a post office ever I don't think it was insane very annoying but I stood it out and did my parcel so now I'm gonna make myself a smoothie have a shower and get on with some work some more fabric swatches just arrived and included in them is this like really pretty light wash denim which I've been looking for a light wash denim for so long that's like a good weight this is really nice so I'm so happy about that and then I also got some more clips for my sketchbook these just are really great at holding in your little samples so I got three boxes of those so yeah I'm all set now I'm going to go make my smoothie this is the attire for the rest of the day my comfy Victoria's Secret boyfriend style joggers my hoodie and some fluffy socks and I've also taken my contact lenses out because they just annoy me I always put bananas in my smoothies and I'm going to these look really green on camera but they're not um, I always like break them up into four and put them in a freezer bag and keep them in the freezer so whenever I want a smoothie I can just pull out a banana and put four bits in so yeah that's my little tip with bananas I also do the same with ginger just put it in little cubes in here and then put some of these in little chunk of ginger and then sometimes I use soy but I think today I'm just gonna use water Probably looks like I haven't moved but I've been working on my sketchbook and I just ran out of my print sticks oh my gosh <laughs> I'm so out of breath and now I look oh it doesn't and now I look like this because I've just been crawling underneath my bed to try and find these <laughs> I should have probably filmed it it was quite funny but now I need to put everything back under my bed because I have finally found my 
I put six. I thought I'd just share something a bit funny. But um, if, for those of you that follow me on my design account, you'll probably think that I've spent ages on my drawings and they all look, try to look, fabulous. <laughs> but I'm going to show you the reality of what my ideas look like when I have an idea. This, my friends, is what gets spurted out. <sighs> this is the worst sketch and a really rough thing of what I want to do. And then I really roughly plan out the pattern and now I'm going to go and cut it for my next outfit. So yeah, just thought I'd share that this is where it normally starts for me. But I just don't put this in my sketchbook because it's ugly. Actually, to be honest, this is normally where it starts with like really random collages. Um, like this, just getting random shape inspiration and things like that. And this is my giant woman. <laughs> Whenever I have an idea pop into my head, I just need to get it down as quickly as I can. <laughs> Otherwise, it goes. So I have a pile of scrap paper on my desk that I reach for if I have a random idea, see if it looks all right. So now I'm going to go onto the floor and do my pattern cutting. I hate this because it makes my back hurt. No, it's not very good for your back, but it's only temporary. It's 11.26 and I am fed up of sewing. <laughs> this still needs a lot of work done to it, but I've kind of finished a dress to go under this jacket. Um, that's pretty good in an evening for me. So in the morning I just need to attach this facing down, stitch it all the way down here, and hem the sleeves and the skirt. I was gonna shower and wash my hair, but it's too late, I think and um, I'm just gonna do it in the morning. It's Tuesday morning and I've got something on from 10 to 11 and I think that's it. Um, so this is my outfit. It looks like it's pretty cold outside so I've got on this jumper from H&M and then I've got on my really warm Adidas puffer jacket, Zara jeans and Zara boots. And that's my outfit for today. Nice and easy and casual. Oh, honestly, the homeware. Look at all the plants. I wish I could take a plant back in the car. Wednesday morning now. I had a tiny bit of a lion and I don't have anything on at uni today which is so nice but it is my tutorial tomorrow so I have to get lots of work done today. I kind of decided my third outfit last night so I'm going to pattern cut and make that today and I also have to sketch out my lineup um, and put the fabrics next to them for tomorrow as well so busy old day. And it's raining which is great because that means I don't want to even go outside. <laughs> Although I think I'm going into town with Ella and Holly at some point. Just to have a mooch and take my mind off work for a little bit and then start back again. So yeah, I'm going to put my hair up and get to it. Let's do this. But first, porridge. Although I'm really going off porridge at the moment so I might have something else. I bought the Sainsbury's own shreddies the other day and they are very, very disappointing. They're definitely worth paying the price for actual shreddies, which is really sad because they're so expensive compared to Sainsbury's shreddies. <gasps> I bought some new bedding in the Zara home sale when it was Black Friday and it's finally arrived. Um, so I'm going to put it on my bed now and show you guys. I'm not really very impressed with this stuff. This is the, yes, 
to Miracle Argan Oil Lip Oil stuff, and it just doesn't really do that much, but I still use it every now and then. So yeah, gonna make my room nice and cozy now. I just washed it all because I can't put new sheets on the bed straight away. I don't think you're meant to. I think you are meant to wash them, so that's what I did. And now I'm gonna put them on the bed. Thursday today and I have my tutorial so I've got all my garments packed up I started to feel really weird last night um, I think I just overworked myself and so I just had to stop it was like 12 <laughs> so I don't have as much as I would want to show today um, but it will do and then we have a briefing for our new written thing at like 12 and then I am going into London, I'm going to see my sister for a bit and we're going to go to a gallery and then I have my management's Christmas drinks which will be fun, I can't stay long at it though because I can't have another really late night and also it's just not very safe travelling really late at night all the way back to here. So yeah, that is the plan for today. I am wearing, at the moment, I'm not wearing this to London, but I'm wearing this really light pink um, waffle top from Brandy Melville. And then I've got these jeans on from Pull and Bear. And then my boots are All Saints. I haven't worn these in forever because they can kind of rub. So I'm gonna try them out again and see if they rub. But yeah, and then I'm just gonna wear my big puffer jacket because it's raining outside so it's quite mild and yet again it gets to the end of the week and Rosie has forgotten to film in the last few days actually no I think I filmed yesterday it's now Friday and I forgot to film what I was wearing to London because I was running late again I don't know why every single time I go to London now I run late and it's really bad I had a really nice evening in London I went fabric shopping and I went to a new gallery that I haven't been to I think it's called Vic to Myro, I think that's what it's called. And then I went out for drinks with my management premiere. Um, that was really nice. So yeah, tonight one of the girls downstairs is having a birthday party, so we're gonna pop down for a bit and just say hello. Um, so I'm gonna show you what I'm wearing. Today I had the worst day ever. I slept until 11.30 and that is just so not me. <laughs> I get up at like eight or before eight, normally every day. So yeah. There's been stress tears today and the works, so I've just decided this is a complete write-off of the day and just gonna get work done tomorrow. I was meant to be going home today and seeing Zach tomorrow, but I've had to cancel both because um, I just don't have the time to get everything done otherwise, which is really sad because I love spending time with my family and with Zach, so it's really sad, but <laughs> anyway. So this is my outfit for tonight. I have literally no makeup on. <laughs> I put a tiny bit through my brows just to make me look a little decent um, and I put like big earrings in to try and distract away from it um, but then I've also gone with this really cute little ruffled top which is from Zara, it's quite old so they don't do it anymore sadly um, and then these jeans which are from Pull and Bear and then I've got on these funky corduroy boots which are from forever 21 i actually haven't worn these out at all yet so i'm doing that tonight so tomorrow i am working flat out and then on sunday we're having like a little christmas meal which will be so nice so i might continue this video on into next week and just do it as a two weekly thing um because i don't think i've i'm not sure if i filmed much this week i don't know so yeah might see you guys tomorrow so it's Saturday morning and I have just been editing last week's video. It was just a weekly vlog, a bit like this one. Um, and I don't know why, it just took me so long to edit it. I kept just getting to points and being like, I'm bored of myself. <laughs> and I just really hate editing these days, I'm not sure why. I think because I just don't have the time to make it how I want it to really look, that it's very frustrating but I can definitely not complain about where I've been doing my work today because I'm in my super 
duper cosy bed with my new Zara bedding on. And now I am just going to go through my sketchbook and decide my next outfits to make and sort of like a timeline of everything because I need to do two more twirled outfits by Thursday morning. I need to stop complaining about it and get on with it. My brain is just not in the headspace for it anymore it's just been like constantly working and working and now it's like i need a break <laughs> but i'm like no <laughs> yeah i also realized that i haven't worn anything except this black hoodie pretty much for this whole week and i've probably worn outfits out but when i'm not <laughs> i'm in this but to be fair if i'm not in this i'm in a dressing gown and i feel like this is more presentable so what can you do i made some vegan chocolate cakes yesterday because I thought that chocolate cakes would motivate me to work so far. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Gonna get on now. Stop rambling. So my sewing went very wrong yesterday. I think I was just so overtired that it kept going wrong. I kept putting the front on the back and the back on the front and things like that. Just stupid things that meant I had to keep unpicking so I just went to bed. But today I am up, I'm ready. I'm gonna get some work done before we have our Christmas thing this afternoon. So hopefully, fingers crossed, today goes a bit better. Decided to wear my other glasses today because I really don't wear them as much as I should. I'm gonna try and get the girls to go on a walk with me because it's so nice outside. The weather is really like crispy cold, but it's really sunny. So yeah, but sewing first. So here's today's outfit. I have on my sheep jacket from H&M. This is also from H&M, it's like a mohair jumper, very itchy if you're thinking about buying it, but I just wear a long sleeve underneath it and it's all right. And then my jeans are little kick flares from Zara and my boots are also Zara and I'm off into uni. Thursday today and I have my toile review. I haven't been filming for the past few days because I've just been getting up at 8, working, going to bed at 12. <laughs> so I haven't really been in the mood to pull out my camera and show me working. Um, but I'm going to take it with me and try and show you my outfits on my models. We'll see. Today I'm wearing this H&M jumper. It's super cosy um, and I have a long sleeve underneath because it's like 4 degrees today. Um, then I've got on these H&M faux leather trousers and then for shoes I've got on these little Nike trainers that I got in the Black Friday sale. They're very flat compared to all of the other trainers I've been wearing recently but I'm quite enjoying it. And then for coat I am just wearing my big Adidas uh, puffer jacket. So yeah I've got my sketchbooks, fabrics and twirls. And I'm gonna carry all of this in. Thankfully, it's not raining. Because the past few times I've had to carry stuff like this in, it's been raining, which is really unhelpful. I'm really excited to get back from this toilet review because I'm gonna have a nap. And I am going to tidy the flat, wash my makeup brushes, do all the things that I've been wanting to do for a while that I haven't had time for. I'm feeling all right about this toilet review. I didn't get one dress made that I wanted to but I got an early night instead and I feel much better for it so let's get back from my tutorial and it went fine lots of little changes that I need to make but it sounds so bad but 
really can't be bothered. <laughs> I think I'm probably going to end the video here. So yeah, now I'm going to have a nap. Ring my mum, tell her how it went. And have some, oh, I've got some hash browns in the oven. <laughs> yeah, that was actually my last day of uni for this year. How weird. Didn't feel like it. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to eat my lunch and have a chilled afternoon and then get back on with work in the evening.